hello guys welcome back to another video so today we are going to build a simple game using android studio so uh, i think all of you have played this game minesweeper game so we are going to build this game today so before we get into uh, how to build this game uh, i have uh, i will uh, i have already add the source code to the github so you guys can go there and check it out also this game is based on uh, this web based game uh, made by amy so uh, this is a git repo so you guys all can also check it out also so what we uh, basically what we have done in here is uh, we put the amy's repo uh, source code into our uh, assets folder over here so uh, there are three uh, html files so uh, in one html file, file it will load the uh, beginners level uh, game so if we open the game so there are three modes beginner level intermediate level or expert level so those three uh, game views are open by these three html files so with this uh, minesweeper js uh, javascript is the uh, game file and those two are its resources okay so what we have done in here is we add those uh, html file to our assets folder and then uh, in layout we have added a web view and spinner and a button so in this spinner uh, you can see it over here so this spinner contains is it a beginner uh, we can select uh, is it a beginner or intermediate or expert level okay according to that uh, this web view down here uh, it will load the game and we i have put this how to play button so if you click it click on it it will show how to play this game So, uh, in in my main activity code, uh, I have added a web view and a spinner, and also I have uh, added these uh, three static strings to select is it a beginner or intermediate or expert level. Uh, so, going through. Uh, first, I have uh, linked those. Uh, web view and the spinner elements with my uh, xml file so uh, this activity layout so you can simply uh, link it like this and then uh, i have created an adapter uh, a list a list of string adapter so uh, those this adapter contains uh, is it a beginner or intermediate or ex expert and then i have add this adapter into the uh, game mode spinner so in the game mode spinner i have uh, created a on item selected listen listener so when i select uh, when you select on this uh, any item what should the thing what should we want to have what what is the action we need to do so those things are written inside here so on items selected first i take the what is the item uh, selected and i check is it a beginner or intermediate or expert 
so according to that i am loading that html file uh, into our web view so that is how simply we can add a html file uh, into our app um, maybe it's a game or maybe it's a web app or anything else we can simply uh, add like this and then finally uh, for the uh, game how to play the game button so uh, if we go into xml code so i have added the on click listener to the our button over here so if we go into the button uh, so this is the action that going to happen if we click on the button so there is a big string like this so uh, it it explains uh, how it going to how the game is playing and i have created an alert box uh, alert dialog and display it. Uh, so i hope you guys got some idea how we can uh, create a small application or a small game like this using html and con connecting it with android studio thanks guys and let's meet with another tutorial next